great time with you at the Royal Ball. Oh, did you bring back Squeaker? You did? Brilliant. Can you pass him over to me, please? Oh, thank you. That's it. Oh, I've got him. Hello, Squeaker. Did you have a good time? <laughs> oh, I'm so pleased. Oh, Squeaker, I was wondering, can we play at the Royal Palace again this week? It was so much fun, wasn't it? <laughs> oh. says he's going to be doing a lot of sleeping. He must have had lots of fun at your house. <laughs> All right, Squeaker, you have a nice sleep and we'll play with you again soon. Off you go. Bye. <gasps> oh, what's that? <gasps> Did you find one too? Well, it's very long and it's black. And it's got a very, very nice star on the top. Do you think it might be a magic wand? I wonder who it belongs to. It could belong to a fairy. Shall we give it a try? Just to check that it's really magic. All right, come on. Swish, 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 swish. Oh! Dear, a magic spark just hurt my nose. I don't think we really should be playing with it, do you? Oh dear. Mm. Ooh. <gasps> I've got that tingly feeling in my fingers again. Have you got that tingly feeling in your fingers too? <gasps> oh, there it is again. It's that. It's that fizzy feeling in my belly. It feels like. Bubbles and lemonade. But I still haven't drank any lemonade. Have you drank any lemonade? Well, how strange. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's getting really tickly. Oh, it's really strong this time. Oh, there must be lots and lots of magic this week, which means we need lots and lots of imagination. Are you ready to say our rhyme? We need imagination and we need a lot. A great big pile, not a tiny dot. So grab yourself a handful. Where will we play today? Underneath the rainbow is where we'll start our day. Oh. They didn't work again. Ah, we're still in the same old place. Hang on. Have I got something on my head? <laughs> what? What's that? Oh, oh, it's very long and very pointy. What is it? <gasps> oh, it's a black witch's hat. Oh. Did you find a black witch's hat too? Oh, do you think this magic wand and this witch's hat are a clue to where we're going today? Ooh, I'm a little bit scared, but we need to be brave because it could be lots of fun. <laughs> right, come on, we're going to say our rhyme one more time. We need imagination and we need a lot. A great big pile, not a tiny dot. So grab yourself a handful. Where will we play today? Underneath the rainbow is where we'll start our day. <gasps> it's working!
that funny noise? Was that your tummy rumbling? Did you have breakfast? Oh, you did? Well, what's that funny noise then? It's coming from around here somewhere. Oh, it's a tiny baby furry caterpillar. Oh, my mummy says I'm not allowed to pick up furry caterpillars. Hmm. I think, I think I better put on my gardening gloves. Do you have gardening gloves? Put them on. That's it. <laughs> now we can pick up our caterpillar. Right, very carefully. <laughs> Come on, baby caterpillar. Oh, hello. Oh my goodness, he's ever so cute. He's very furry, isn't he? Is yours furry? And mine's got purple spots on his belly. <laughs> I'm going to ask my caterpillar what his name is. Are you going to ask your caterpillar what his name is too? Come on then. What's your name, Mr. Caterpillar? Put him up to your ear. Oh, I didn't really understand caterpillar language. Um, shall we just ask him again? Um, Mr. Caterpillar, can you say that again, please? What's your name? <coughs> oh, Mr. Caterpillar said his name was Bob. <laughs> What's your caterpillar's name? No, <laughs> that's a funny name. <laughs> oh, oh. My caterpillar is all shivery and shaky. Oh, Bob, what's wrong, Bob? Oh. <laughs> oh, Bob, goodness, did you hear? Bob said there's a nasty old witch who lives in the forest and she likes to eat caterpillar soup for lunch. Oh, poor Bob thinks he's going to end up in the witch's tummy. Oh, Bob. We'll protect you from the nasty old witch. We'll protect our caterpillars, won't we? Oh, I've got a good idea. If we feed our caterpillars lots and lots of juicy leaves, they'll grow big and fat and strong and then they'll be able to run away from the witch. <laughs> what a brilliant idea, right? Well, we just need to find some juicy leaves. Well, there's some over there and there's some over there, but they don't look very juicy. Oh, hang on, what's this? <laughs> Got something in my pocket. Hang on, Bob, what is it? <gasps> I've got some seeds in my pocket. Bob, this is great news. Seeds and a hungry caterpillar. We can grow some juicy leaves for Bob and all the caterpillars. Right, okay, Bob, you run along and I will grow you some juicy leaves. Right, off you go, Bob. Okay, have you got, have you got your, your, your seeds? All right, okay, now, um, I'm pretty sure that seeds go in the ground. Okay, so um, we're going to need a trowel. Here we go, I've got mine. Have you got your trowel? All right, we're going to dig a little hole for our seeds. Can you help? That's right. right that's enough. That's it. Brilliant. Right, we're going to put our seeds in the hole. Right, ready? Can you help? One, two, three, four. One for luck, five. Right, and pat it down. That's it. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> right, well, we just have to wait for our seeds to grow now. Oh, it's taking ages, isn't it? Are we doing something wrong? Do seeds need anything to grow? They do. They need water. Oh, of course they need water. 
Right, well, I can see a big old rain cloud up there in the sky. I think that cloud has got lots and lots of water in it. So, how about, how about we put our hands up in the air, grab hold of the cloud, that's it, and give it a good old squeeze. Squeeze! Let's get all that rain out. Squeeze! I think it might be working. The rain falls down from up high. Splish, splash, splosh, it falls from the sky. Where does all the rain go? Into the soil so our flowers can grow. I think, I think I can see a little sprout. Can you? It's working. <laughs> right, I think seeds also need some sunshine. And there's the sun up there in the sky. Can you point to it? The sun shines down from up high. It's yellow light, it falls from the sky. Where does the sunshine go? Into the soil so the flowers can grow. My seeds are growing big and tall. I think I can even see the beginning of a juicy leaf and a very beautiful flower. Shall we be the flowers, growing big and tall? Put your hands in the air. The flowers grow really high. Their pretty heads reach up to the sky. Now I'm glad that I know the rain and the sunshine helps us to grow. <laughs> it's working! Right, I think we should sing our song again all the way through and make sure that our seeds grow big and tall with lots of juicy leaves. Let me put the music on and grab hold of that rain cloud. That's it, give it a squeeze. The rain falls down from up high. Splish, splash, splosh, it falls from the sky. Where does all the rain go? Into the soil so our flowers can grow. It's working. Right, now we need the sunshine. The sun shines down from up high. It's yellow light, it falls from the sky. Where does the sunshine go? Into the soil so the flowers can grow. Yay, they're growing big and tall. Let's be the flowers. The flowers grow really high. Their pretty heads reach up to the sky. Now I'm glad that I know. The rain and the sunshine helps us to grow. Wow, we did it! We've got lots and lots of juicy leaves and lots of beautiful flowers. Let's call our caterpillars. Bob! Bob! Here he comes. Right, I'm going to put my caterpillar on, on this juicy leaf right here. Ooh. Can you put your caterpillar on the juicy leaf? Oh, look! <laughs> They're eating it. Wow. He's going to grow really big and fat. And then he's going to be really strong. And then he's going to be able to run away from the witch. Yes, we did it. Brr, brr. Oh. Brr, brr. Hang on a minute. That's my telephone. Excuse me. <laughs> brr, brr. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's the witch calling. Brr. Oh, I don't want to answer it. Brr, brr. Will you answer it? Brr, brr. Oh, all right, I will. Brr, brr. Oh. Hello? <laughs> Would you like to come to lunch in the forest? I'm making vegetable soup and I'm having lots of yummy scrummy chocolate cake for dessert. Uh, hang on a minute, witch. <laughs> um, she just asked if we wanted to go to lunch <laughs> in the forest. And she said she was having chocolate cake <laughs> and vegetable soup, not caterpillar soup. What do you think, guys? Hmm, shall we just make sure? Um, witch, you're definitely, definitely, definitely having vegetable soup, aren't you? And not caterpillar soup. <laughs> 
soup? Don't be silly. Of course I'm having vegetable soup. And I would really, really like your company. Oh, hang on a minute, witch. I'll just double check. Oh, she does sound really nice. And I do like chocolate cake. <laughs> Shall we say we're going to go? <laughs> All right, OK. <gasps> All right, witch. We'll come for lunch. Um, yeah, we'll see, you, we'll see you soon. We'll see you in about five minutes. All right, bye. Oh, my goodness. We're going to lunch at the witch's house. All right, guys. Well, we better stand up and find out where she lives. It's time to go into the forest. Do you know the way to the witch's house? Oh, I'm feeling really scared. This forest is ever so dark. Will you walk with me? Shall we try over there? Okay, let's be brave. Ribbit! Ribbit! What was that noise? Did you hear that really funny noise? Ribbit! What is it? Oh, oh! It's a little frog! Hello, little frog! Oh! Oh, he's ever so jumpy! Hello, little frog! What are you doing in the deep, dark forest? Ooh. Oh, he jumped away. Oh, we should keep going. Maybe we should try over this way. Oh, tweet, 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 tweet. Well, what is that strange noise? What could it be this time? Oh, it's okay. It's just a tiny little bird up in the tree. Oh, can you see? She's so cute. Maybe she knows the way to the witch's house. Um, little bird, do you know the way to the witch's house? Aw, she flew away, didn't she? Oh, goodness. I really hope we're close. And I don't like all these strange noises. Hmm. Let's just try over there. Come on, follow me. friendly house in the forest. Mm. Can you smell? I can smell yummy vegetable soup as well. We made it. Right, I'll see you inside. Ooh, that soup looks very yummy. Mm. It smells delicious too. It doesn't smell like caterpillars. Hmm, there's still no sign of the witch. Maybe we should just try a little bit. <laughs> Soup on the table. A napkin on my lap. Have you got your napkin? Ooh, what's that floating in my bowl? Uh. Oh! <laughs> It's just a pea. <laughs> what a lovely lunch. Mm, a great big spoonful. Ready? Mm, caterpillar crunch. Mm. <laughs> I think I just ate a caterpillar. 
caterpillar. Uh, uh, it was all crunchy. Uh, 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 what is it? Uh, uh, uh. Oh, pfft. it's just a carrot. <laughs> Phew, I thought it was a caterpillar. Um, oh, shall we have some more? <laughs> it is very nice. Soup on the table. A napkin on my lap. Ugh. What's that floating in my ball? Oh, that's right, it's just a carrot and a pea. Mm, what a lovely lunch. A great big spoonful. Caterpillar crunch! <laughs> Get it out! What is it? It's just a noodle! <laughs> it's just a noodle! Phew! I thought it was a caterpillar for a minute! I'll pop it back in. Right, we'll just have a little bit more. It is very yummy. Soup. On the table, a napkin on my lap. Ooh, what's that floating in my ball? Can you remember? <laughs> That's right, it's just a noodle and a, a carrot and a, a pea. What a lovely lunch. A great big spoonful. Ooh, caterpillar crunch. Oh, I really think that was a caterpillar that time. Ooh, it was really crunchy. Ooh, and it tastes like caterpillar too. Ooh, what is it? Oh no. I don't know what that is. I think it actually might be a caterpillar. Oh, where's Bob? Did you bring Bob? Did you bring your caterpillar? Oh no, Bob, Bob, Bob. Oh, he's not in my pocket. Oh, what's that by my ear? You're okay. I thought for a minute I'd eaten you in my soup. Oh, what's that funny noise? It sounds really magical. What's that, Bob? Oh, he's trying to tell us something. Did your caterpillar tell you too? Bob says that magical noise means that something very magical is about to happen. And he says we have to take him into the garden as soon as possible. Oh, all right, Bob. Um, we will. Have you got your caterpillar? Okay. All right, come on, Bob. Let's go in the garden. Well, here we are in the garden. Oh, Bob, look around. Isn't it beautiful? I can hear the birds singing and, oh, I can feel magic in the air as well. You know what? I think Bob is going to undergo a very huge and magical transformation from a caterpillar to a... Oh, shall we find out? Okay, we're going to help our caterpillars have their amazing transformation. So first of all, we need to find them a very nice tree. Let's have a look. Oh, <laughs> there's one. I'm going to put my caterpillar in the tree. And I think I'm going to hang in this tree right here. Okay, the first thing we need to do is start winding our silk. That's it. 
Good winding, everybody. And now we're going to wind the silk around our bodies. Round and round we go. Good job, Bob. Right, until we're very, very wrapped up nice and tight. <gasps> oh, I can hardly move and the wind is blowing me around in the tree. There's enough magic in the air for us to fly home. Show me your beautiful wings. I'll see you soon. We flew all the way home. I flew so high in the sky, didn't you? Oh, wasn't Bob just a beautiful butterfly? Oh, we did such a great job today, guys. We saved Bob and all of our caterpillar friends from that mean old witch. We did feel a little bit sorry for her though, did you? She threw her broomstick all down on the ground in a big old huff. Ah, she never did get to have any lunch. That's probably why she was so angry. Maybe, just maybe, we could invite the witch to our house for dinner. That would be very nice of us, wouldn't it? I'm having a barbecue. Not barbecue caterpillars though, so she better like it. What are you having for dinner? Mmm, maybe you could call the witch too and invite her to your house for dinner. Oh, that would be ever so nice of you. <laughs> oh, I've got a funny tingling feeling in my fingers again. Do you have a funny tingling feeling in your fingers too? Ooh, I'm not quite sure what's happening, but I have felt it before. Oh, that's right. The colours of the rainbow are fading. We've used imagination and we've used a lot. A great big pile not a tiny dot so say goodbye to all your friends and hello to the moon oh don't be sad we should be glad because we'll see each other soon don't forget to call the witch invite her for dinner and i'll see you soon bye for now